Hi and welcome to another video of SpaceX update. Early this morning, SpaceX successfully launched the National Reconnaissance Office's classified payload, NROL-85, into space. One, zero, ignition. Lift off the Falcon 9. Go NROL-85. This was SpaceX's 14th successful launch of this year and kept a clean record of 100% recovery of its Falcon 9 boosters. It was also the first time that the National Reconnaissance Office trusted SpaceX's reliable Falcon 9 rocket and agreed to use the same booster that launched NROL-87 earlier this year in February. Stage 1 landing confirmed. After three unsuccessful attempts for a smooth wet dress rehearsal test, NASA has decided to temporarily stop the testing campaign of its SLS rocket. NASA announced on its website that the Mega Moon rocket will be rolled back to the Vehicle Assembly Building. The decision came after facing technical issues with the rocket, its mobile launch tower, and ground systems that supply propellants and gases. NASA says. Due to upgrades required at an off-site supplier of gaseous nitrogen used for the test, NASA will take advantage of the opportunity to roll SLS and Orion back to the Vehicle Assembly Building to replace a faulty upper stage check valve and a small leak on the tail service mast umbilical. During that time, the agency also will review schedules and options to demonstrate propellant loading operations ahead of launch. It will take some days to prepare the rocket to roll back to the Vehicle Assembly Building and many days to fix the issues and again prepare the rocket for a second rollout. Could the next opportunity for a wet dress rehearsal be slipped to June or July? I don't know, only NASA will know. If these issues are more serious than everyone expected, will they threaten to delay NASA's ambition of sending humans back to the moon? To get all the answers, tune into NASA's press conference later this afternoon. SpaceX's brand new Dragon capsule, Freedom, as dubbed by NASA's Crew-4 missions crew, arrived yesterday at Kennedy's Space Center's Launch Complex 39A. Crew-4 mission is NASA's crewed mission to the ISS as part of its commercial crew program and is scheduled to lift off no earlier than April 23. After a flight readiness review last week involving the officials from NASA, SpaceX, and European Space Agency, all teams are go for launch for this mission, after tracking no significant issues in the build-up. That's it for now. If you like the content of this channel, please consider subscribing so that you don't miss any SpaceX-related news in the future.